I'm Theo Witzel, botanist and ecologist with the Arkansas Natural Heritage Commission, and I'm also the curator of the Natural Heritage Commission Herbarium. An herbarium is a collection of dried, preserved, scientific plant specimens. The collection we have here has about 7,500 specimens fully processed, that is mounted onto the archival paper and stored in these herbarium cabinets. And we have several thousand others that are in process or being mounted. Herbarium specimens are really the physical record of plant diversity um, on Earth. We find new species new to the state every year. These are a few of Arkansas's rarest plants. In fact, all of these species here are found only in Arkansas, nowhere else in the world. Maple leaf oak is this species here, Quercus acerifolia. It's found only at the top of four really high mountains in Arkansas and nowhere else on the planet. This is the Cassatot leaf cup. It's known from just five populations in the world, all in the most rugged parts of the Ouachita Mountains, within a few miles of each other. Uh, in Polk and Montgomery County, down in that area. Brown's water leaf is known uh, in what we call mesic or really moist, rich forests in, the, in that same sort of rugged part of the Washita Mountains along streams. And this is one of the most recently described species in Arkansas, Pelton's rose gentian. And uh, this is the one that was, uh, is found only in Saline County and was described in 2005. One of the uh, most tangible benefits of the herbarium collections in, uh, in the state recently is the publication of the Atlas of the Vascular Plants of Arkansas. We use the herbarium every day that we're in the office. It never gets old. There's plants all around us, so everywhere you go there's something to look at, something to study, and uh, something to, to discover.